Cabbage is one of those vegetables that just keeps so well in the refrigerator. It can be good for weeks in the refrigerator. And that's why I always have some on hand in the refrigerator. I love to roast it. I like grating it into salads. I like to saute it and add it to mashed potatoes. Today, I'm gonna to show you another way I like to use cabbage, and that is in an apple and cabbage slaw. And with a nice honey mustard dressing that's sweet and tart, this is delicious. And I like to use the red cabbage for this salad. And I'll show you how to make it from start to finish. It doesn't take long at all. And the first thing I'm going to do is the honey mustard dressing. The honey mustard dressing has a base of mayonnaise. I've got a third cup of mayonnaise here and honey. So I've got a quarter cup of honey. So I'm going to add some whole grain Dijon mustard. And that just means that there's whole mustard seeds right into this mixture. And then I'm going to put in some creamy Dijon and that just gives it some really nice bite to it as well as some little spiciness. So I'm just gonna stir that up a little bit before I add some fresh lime zest. And remember, any kind of citrus zest is just the thin colored part on the outside of the fruit. So I've grated that with my zester. I'll put it right in, as well as the juice from one whole lime. So it's probably about a couple tablespoons from one lime. And I'll stir that up good, blend it well. It'll be nice and creamy. And right at the last minute, I'm going to add some chia seeds. I'll set this aside and we'll mix up the cabbage salad. I've already got some really thinly sliced red cabbage in my bowl and I'm going to add about half cup of sliced green onions and one apple that I've sliced really thin into almost like matchstick pieces but a little bit bigger than matchsticks. And I'll just kind of mix that up a little bit. And now I'm ready to add some dressing to it. So you just want to add enough to make sure that everything is really coated well. You may not need all of it, just toss it up a little bit. And if you need more, you can add more. When you're lucky, you might find a red cabbage in the grocery store that has those nice outer leaves that you can just pull off and they form a really nice little bowl. And so I'm just going to put some of the salad right into the cabbage bowl and I'll sprinkle it with some of my toasted broken up pecan pieces. And there we have a wonderful cabbage and apple slaw. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.